My name is Carly Emery, and I'm a recent graduate at SIU. I studied aviation management and aviation flight, and now I'm a full-time flight instructor at the university. This is the lobby of the Transportation Education Center, also known as the Tech. The Tech houses are aviation management, aviation flight, and aviation technologies majors. The Tech is located a couple miles northwest of the main campus. Here in the lobby hangs our Cessna 152 that represents our flying Salukis. Our flying Salukis compete nationally and have won now a total of nine national championships. Down the hall to our left is our flight operations and off to our right is our faculty and our instructor offices where our students meet and uh, meet with their instructors and the faculty members. We're gonna go ahead and move on down to flight operations to give you a further look. Welcome to our flight operations. This is where our aviation flight students start their day, whether it be them checking in for their flight or waiting for an airplane, checking the weather, or meeting with their instructor to go over their flight planning. When our student checks in for their flight, they receive an aircraft packet that has the keys and the checklist to enable them to be ready to go fly. Our, we also have our executive transport offices where our senior students have the opportunity to fly advanced aircraft. Now we'll move on to our flight simulators in this room over there. Welcome to our flight simulation center. This is where we have five state-of-the-art simulators. We have three Cessna 172 simulators, a CRJ simulator, and a crosswind motion trainer behind me. This allows students to fly in challenging conditions while still doing it safely. Now we'll go upstairs to our ATC simulator. This is our air traffic control flight simulator. In addition to our three majors, we give our students the opportunity to pursue a minor in air traffic control. The main simulator behind me gives the students the opportunity to act as if they were in the tower controlling traffic coming into land. The room back there gives the students the opportunity to act as if they were approach or center. Now we'll go outside to meet Tommy and he'll show you our fleet. Hey guys, my name is Tommy. I'm a senior here in the Aviation Flight and Technologies programs at SIU. Behind me you can see our flight line and our planes are parked and ready for students to go fly. We have 38 different types of training aircraft at SIU, including Cessna 172s, 152s, 310s, and Piper Arrows. We have a mix of analog and advanced avionics in our planes. Here you can see a 737 donated to us by United and a Gulfstream donated to us by the Navy. In front of me is our hangar that houses all of our training aircraft. And next, we'll be transitioning to the maintenance hangar. Welcome to our aircraft maintenance hangar. Students will work to get their bachelor's degree in aviation technologies as long as, along with their airframe and power plant certificates. All the planes you see behind me are used by students to achieve these ratings. In the back left, we have our sheet metal lab. That's where students learn how to fabricate and repair sheet metal structures, along with our gas turbine lab to my right where students learn to repair and overhaul jet engines. Upon completing your aviation degrees, you have the option to specialize in one of three areas, either avionics, which is located down my hall and to the left, or advanced composites down the hall and to the right, or a helicopter lab, and that's where we're going now. to check out a UH-1 that was flown in Vietnam along with other helicopters that we have. Welcome to our helicopter maintenance facility. In this lab, once you're done with your airframe and power plant courses, you can choose helicopters as a specialization. We have multiple different types of helicopters and models to work on. Everything from a Bell 47, the Bell 206 Jet Ranger, a UH-1 from Vietnam, and the commercial version of the UH-1, the Bell 205. In, these, in this lab, you'll learn all about field maintenance and overhauling components. This hangar houses both lab and lecture area. Now let's go on to the test cell where we can observe a class and process. This is our aviation test cell. The test cell was built in 2012. It holds four test cells in it, two for reciprocating engines, two for jet engines. As you can see behind me, there are students disassembling and reassembling reciprocating engines, which they'll later test in the test cells. The uh, jet test cells are used to run aircraft under specified conditions. We also have this large hangar space for students to bring in aircraft, demount the engines from the aircraft, along with our two turbine test cells used to run jet engines.
Thank you for joining us on our tour of SIU Aviation today. For more information, you can go online at aviation.siu.edu. We look forward to seeing you soon.